So I know that Naga 3 is trying to, well, in the investment in Naga 3, you're trying to cut down Capex as much as you can to be able to make sure that there's stability within the company going forward and not overextend yourselves, obviously. Uh, previously, they'd been, it'd been talked about as being something like a $3.5 billion project. Has that changed? Yeah, you know, if you go back to the original announcements, which were in 2019, and obviously uh, those numbers in that environment uh, uh, and conditions on the ground uh, all dictated uh, the plans at that time. Now, essentially, the financial arrangement is still there. The original, uh, call it pledge or commitment, is three and a half billion. Uh, half was going to be uh, put up uh, by the company, half by uh, with the with the founder, Dr. Chen, and now his trust, 50-50 uh, financing. That remains intact. However, you know, if you recall in 2021, uh, 21 or early 22, we announced that we were going to move that date out from 2027 or 26 all the way out to 2029. That was a result of that major disruption I keep referring to called COVID. Fan Chen, uh, I think, explained it well in uh, some of the briefing we had with analysts that uh, we're going to do a very significant evaluation uh, that's already begun in terms of uh, resizing, uh, reloading uh, the design and data. You know, uh, it wouldn't make much sense if we added the uh, 3,500 additional hotel rooms to the 1,700. That put us well over 5,000 hotel rooms. And we're certainly, uh, like anybody else, we, we want to see those rooms occupied. So the resizing, uh, the reevaluation will cause some adjustments and amendments. As you're probably aware now, you know, we've spent about uh, 650, 700 uh, million uh, uh, capitalization uh, so far, dealing with the piling, foundation work, the basement work. That's all going to be completed. Uh, by the first quarter of 2024, right, right now, another month or so. Then we're going to uh, go ahead and proceed with the podium or the entertainment complex. Most of that, 90-some uh, percent, as we originally announced, will be non-gaming. You know, uh, we want to make Naga 3 uh, clearly uh, a tourism asset for the country. For more insights from Timothy McNally, make sure to check out our website, YouTube, and social media at Asia Gaming Brief.